Alright, Star Wars fans, this toy haul video is for you. And I would like to share with all Star Wars fans because a few people have asked that I uh, whether I've got any Star Wars figure lately. And some are old, some are new. But uh, I say there has never been a better time to pick these up. And uh, here's the bag for my uh, local comic shop. This is the 4 Google Comics located in Smithtown, New York. Or Long Island. There's a phone number in the website. Uh, okay, here is their logo. For War Comics and Toys. Very nice. And um, I'm gonna show you the stuff in the bags uh, later. But uh, I want to show you this one. This one is actually very rare and very elusive. Hard to find and also very expensive online. But... Uh, I want to show you the man that started it all and it is Django Fett the vintage collection I think this is series 4 uh, yeah series 4 uh, Django Fett from the attack of the clone look at that very nice this is the first time and the only time I'm gonna see this guy in person so might as well pick him up yeah this one cost me about $14 here's the back Alright, and uh, like I said, some are new, some are old. Uh, the next two that I have, you know, I've gotten for a while, but I haven't, uh, I didn't show uh, on video yet. And it is the uh, Series 6, Return of the Jedi, General Lando Calrissian. Alright. And from the Empire Strike Back, I have the... Uh, Dagobah Landing Luke Skywalker very cool uh, I actually got this like I guess like more than a month ago I didn't I didn't show it on video uh, I got it brand new you know like just right out of the box from 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 Walmart and as you can see the punch uh, the punch tab is still there very nice okay put them aside and let's show you what I have in the in the back all right uh, okay new stuff this is the kiss stuff uh, it is the uh, McDonald new clone water motion and it is uh, c3po <laughs> okay this one is a, a little bit of a silly toy because all this is a sticker and with the uh, with the bubble body uh, C3, C3PO on top. Uh, next, I have the Yoda lightsaber, green, very nice. I was looking for the uh, the levitation Yoda with the force kind of gimmicks, but that one was very hard to find. Maybe it's it's uh, hasn't come out yet, but uh, I'm sure to keep an eye out on this one. This one is Anakin. Skywalker lightsaber and this one is Maze Windu lightsaber I'm not sure what the gimmicks on this one is but uh, from the instruction on the website is it's really hard to tell this one has a light gimmick and Yoda has the uh, sound effect gimmick right. okay what's next and this one I got from my uh, yeah my local comic shop and it, you know they are just some old figure loose figure actually oh there's one more in there and I couldn't be happier you know for big Anakin fans like me I picked up uh, episode 1 Anakin look at that guy <laughs> isn't he cool he comes with uh, a little blaster and his backpack and this I have no idea what this is. It's a long time ago from a uh, from the own toy line, I think by Kenner. Yeah, I got it for five twenty nine. Very cool. Is uh this guy is gonna be uh in my uh, Anakin Evolution set to Dark Vader. Okay. And next I have the uh Little Anakin again. This is at the end of the uh, Phantom Menace, where uh, Obi Wan is gonna train him uh, um, as an uh, as a Padawan. 
in the scene where they were uh, burning Qui Gon Jinn. Yeah, this is the Anakin from that scene. And there is an an another Anakin, and this is the uh, the final battle uh, in the in the uh, Revenge of the Sith. Uh, this is Anakin with the burn body. You can see his robotic arm, and looks like it's a quick change Anakin from from Anakin to um to Dark Vader. It's not. It's actually Dark Anakin. And inside of this one, he has no body. <laughs> uh, and it's just there's just a head. Look like you're gonna put this one over the burn Anakin. Okay. And this is the Council Seat Master Yoda. You can see Yoda right there. There's very little articulation, but uh, the head sculpt is really, really well done. I have to say. And looks like the paint is chipping, but uh, it's really no big deal. I just get, I just wanted a so a um, not soda. I was about to say soda, but Yoda figure. I apologize. Okay, I just want a, a wanted a Yoda figure on the council seat, and if if only I can collect all the Jedi Master from the live action movie, that would be great. You know, to form the Jedi Council, it would be super awesome. And he comes with that. Uh, electronic thing. I have no idea what it is. Uh, you know, it's uh, it's from a, an old toy line. I'm not very f uh, very familiar with. Is that a Jedi? Okay. Uh, but anyway, he here are my four old figures that I've got, and these are four new uh, toys from McDonald and the three uh, vintage figure that I couldn't be happier to get alright uh, especially Django Fett I mean I've been looking for, for that guy for like forever uh, but for now these three are staying in packaging because I'm definitely not gonna open Django Fett uh, definitely expect some uh, review on these if I can find Yoda that would be awesome and for these I am not Sure. I mean, if you guys want me to review them, just go ahead and ask or say that. Because I, you know, I watched a review by uh, a guy named Nabil. I think he was one of my subscribers. If I can find his channel, I'm gonna post a link down in the description. He found this one along with the episode one Obi Wan. So and an oh and an episode one Qui Gon Jinn. So I figure I just pay a visit to my local comic shop and they just had a you know a whole bin full of loose figure and these four are just uh, the four interesting one that I was able to dig out so very cool alright if you want me to review any of these just, uh, just uh, request it but uh, for those three I'm gonna keep in packaging big Star Wars fans uh, you know I am just gonna you know Keep collecting, never get tired of Star Wars, they are just so awesome. And alright, here are my toy haul for all my Star Wars stuff that I have picked up lately. And thanks for watching.